Today, we are playing Mibibli's Quest. Why? Well, quite simply, I'm here to celebrate because we finally got, for our, my podcast, business cards. Elder God podcast business cards. And even says all this shit on the back. Oh, I almost dropped it. But, <coughs> really cool. And to celebrate, ooh, look at that catch. See that catch? We are going to be playing my favorite game of all time, Mibibli's Quest for the PC by Ryan Melmoth. Now, this is one of my favorite games. I'm playing the Steam version, which is update some stuff. Maybe I'll get into it. I'm not going to explain everything, but... Got my Xbox controller here. And we're going to dive right in. Uh, this is ZRX, but I use Joy to Keep to uh, use my controller, you know. Uh, we're actually not going to play this one. There we go. A new game. Let's begin. What is my Bibli's quest? Well, we'll get into that. First, we gotta choose our difficulty, though. So first up, we got my Bibli mode. This is the main mode. This is how the game is meant to be played. As you can see, we have, we have the uh, two eye Biblies, the health bar is a little normal size. We got my Bibli there, we got some spikes, but we switch to the easy. Music gets a little quieter, and we get a lot of easier stuff going on here. But, double easy. I guess plays this pathetic song here. Really pathetic here. Double health, even more platforms. If you got playing double easy, I don't blame you, because this game is actually kind of hard. We also got Insanity Shuffle. Try to beat this fucker. Um, we may do that after we beat the game. I don't know why I don't have it unlocked. I played it already. I haven't beat it yet. I used to have a save file, but I don't know what happened to it. But we're gonna hop into mid bibbly mode. I'm not a bitch. Here we are. This is Mibibli's quest. Exciting stuff. Now we're about to enter one of the great tutorial levels of our time. Let's go. Art Zone. Level 1. Right away, you're gonna hear that banging soundtrack. I love. Beautiful. Hello, welcome to the art world. This is uh, our first NPC. We usually greeted by an NPC every episode. Heavy level, excuse me, I don't like that episode. Anyway, you're gonna notice it's kinda like Mega Man, where we shoot these shurukens. They don't go very far though. I get these rocks to clear our way. Here's our first enemy, these Fly Iblis. I don't know the actual name, but I'm calling them Fly Iblis. And we also have these paint rollers. I'm gonna shoot these, teaching us that we can shoot things. Some health here if you really need it. We got a pencil. Just gonna kill it real quick. I don't know what hit me there, but I'll take it. A little shortcut here, go up this way. Get that. Bam, we're in here now. These guys are gonna be eyeballing us here. Go down here. I can't shoot them. I don't know what they do if they see us. We're about to find out. Let's take a picture! Oh, what the hell? Game's wacky and zany. Spikes are instant kill. Sissy, Sissenus. This is not a bike. I don't know. That's a French reference, I believe. You get max lives at every checkpoint. Good to know. And this is a very common enemy you're gonna get introduced to. These guys do a lot of damage. See how much damage that guy did to me? Uh, get out of his line of sight. Oh shit. Ooh, me in there, boys. Now, this is pretty cool. A little cool tutorial here. So you're gonna be like, what do you do? You're gonna learn that your shurukens actually fall down when they go to the edge of the screen. Very cool. Very uh, tutorial-y. Very learny. I like it. And you're going to this LSD type area now. It's pretty fun. Wow. Fly at least. Maybe butterfly at least. I don't know what they actually call Yeah, I'm actually gonna grab the safety help I can parkour. Go down here. Hmm. Love the soundtrack, man. I just love this gaming channel. Why am I playing this game? Why am I doing a let's play? Why am I doing this in a Gumby costume? I don't know. I was told to. I am an indecipherable piece of crappy art. Don't say that by yourself, man. Here we go. Arch nemesis. Arch enemy. Crocodibly. 
Okay, I'll shoot him. Whoa. What's going on? We're in our first boss fight. Crocodibly. So he's gonna start off by doing this like random like seizure attack with like random little pellets everywhere. Be careful to dodge him. It's a little hard to play with the Gumby costume, I'm gonna be honest here. So this is a pretty simple boss fight. He's gotta shoot. I don't know if I explain it, but the only thing we can do right now is jump and shoot. Will we gain more abilities later? Maybe. What is he doing? This fucking guy. No, he's walking aggressively. Wah! What the fuck is that? Now fly up. Oh, look at this. I don't know what I would call this. A man in a cage? Right between two pong paddles? Here. You gotta see spells with <laughs> the costume on, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I'm putting that some safety health here. Oh, I get in here. What is this guy doing? Oh, not again. What the hell? What the hell? This is a game for test patience. It's a great thing to notice there that the shurikens do go down the edge of the screen, for whatever reason. Or uh, the void zone. So I'm just crap it down. I don't know what I'm saying. Hopefully, uh, if I gotta take him down one more time, maybe he'll stop healing. Is he really healing? Like, there's a place in the bar. Not really healing. The Bibli and Croc daily continue to fight for an immeasurably long time. Eventually, they got bored and parted ways. It's all set up. Now we're in. I don't know where we are. What's going on? How did I make that sound? I never, never made that sound there before. And now we are in Yum Town. You may think this is a hub, but it's honestly. Just sad people. Should have what I to say. This place perpetually smells bad, and I have lived here my whole life. I have only smelled bad smells. Sometimes I wet my pants and anyone makes fun of me. Maybe this woman smelling this guy's pants. I like to just die, but I haven't earned my pension yet. Yeah, I mean, capitalism, bro. Do what everyone tells you, alright? If you don't work hard, you don't deserve to eat. You got Mr. Republican himself here. I am so beautiful, everything owned is designer. Don't you wish you were me? This is sad. I wish I looked pretty. No, no, no one wants me. No, no one cares of me. I ain't lose weight. Right. This guy is sick. Damn, you're so ugly. You're gross. You. Wanna fuck? Oh, I'm good right now, but. I'm gonna know if I have a penis. Oh. You are a hero. Oh, shit. What's going on? We're glitching out, guys. Look, guys, we're in the thumbnail of this video. Some rocks here? Where will we be going? What is this? What's going on? I'm frightened. I'm being taken somewhere. What an epic intro right there. It goes to some random art level, we go to a town full of Republicans. And now, where are we? Well, my friends, we are at World 1. 
Yep, build one. So we got city, so question marks, rave, and cave. What if we go down here? Some funky music. Hmm, looks like I need three more hammers to clear this path. Can you help? We have some farm animals here. So it looks like we need some hammers. We got three levels, we need three hammers. Well, I guess I know what I gotta do. I gotta get some damn hammers in the city. Here we go, our first real level, the city. I say, there's nothing more tricks by man than this hat. Oh, 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 there's no true, no true truth. We actually get a hat here. It's not a power up, just like a cosmetic. They were playing Overwatch. Oh boy. I would like to go really far without dying. <laughs> I'm not playing the Dibblies. I'm already low health. I already died. I'm, I'm a, I'm a loser. Let's play for real this time. Okay, this time for sure. Trust me. We're gonna go to the loot box. I think a speedrun strat you can do here. Maybe I'll show that off later. Okay, so I really can't see with this Gumby costume on, so. Hopefully, we do good. We got a nuclear waffle here. He's gonna be shooting plus signs at us. We got a dog. Now there's two nuclear waffles, but hopefully. Almost done here. Yes. Yeah, oh god. Oh god. Come on. Come on. Open the damn gates, man! Okay. Next life. My hat is too small for my very slightly larger than average size head. Okay. I could kill that guy with that bomb those. Oh yeah, I should explain what's going on. We got these hashtags no exploding. And we got more hashtags. More hashtags. And now this guy is smiling. I have a new mechanic here. These little clouds. Every time you jump on them, they're gonna go up. Jump off them, they go up. If you stand on them, they're gonna go right. Pretty handy. You can use that to dodge this spike. Now we gotta do a little bit of platforming here. Ready for this? Platforming in my my platforming in my platforming game impossible. I don't know why I can't play. I'm getting first video jitters right now. We gotta do a big boy jump here. There we go. Easier than it looks. No, harder than it looks. Oh God. <laughs> it's really hard to see. But it's gonna be custom on. At many hats. <laughs> I'm, I'm making this game look easy, but let me tell you, this game is actually super hard. Maybe I'm just bad. Oh, it was bad. But this is Factor Bibbly. He's gonna shoot smoke, and he's gonna jump up and down, and he's gonna come at you. And he's gonna do a big boy jump with his Tims, and then he's gonna repeat it. Pretty simple boss. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Cool trick you can do here is uh just go under him and then he won't attack you. And that's it. That's the first boss. Well yeah, first real boss I guess. Done. Done like dinner. About to go make me a Salisbury steak, mac and cheese, and potatoes. Woo! And what do we get for our troubles? Why, it's the first hammer, of course. I actually had a hammer, um, I don't know what to call it. My counter has like a thing that you like lift up and it has hinges on it to like extend the counter. And uh, my good friend Michael Sal, I don't say his real name, whatever, you know his name, just look, you can easily find me. But he decided to open it up and I don't think it was supposed to open because then it got stuck. And then I tried to close it, then the hinges got bent. So then I had to like use a hammer and I like, I had to hammer hammer the shit out of it try to fix it and uh, it didn't really work I broke it but uh 
Anyway, that's going to do it for this episode of Midblue's Quest. I am Big Beth. Uh, next time, we shall head into... I don't know. Probably Rave. Rave's a banger. See you guys then.